and Alex that Rance. Can, that can go on. How big a loss is Alex Rance? A perennial in your top 50, in your top 10? Oh, he's perennial all Australian. Um, well, Not just you, to I, Richmond, but really to the game. He's oh, to the game. Of his generation. Let's talk about the game more than Richmond. Richmond won the flag without yeah. him. We've moved on from Alex Rance. Richmond have moved on from Alex Rance. If he puts his hand up tomorrow and rings down at home, he says, hey, boss, thinking about coming back, what do you reckon? Harley's not going to say no. But let's talk about the person that Alex Rance is. He's a polarising figure. People have blown away that I had him in my top ten in like five years running. I thought he was the best defender since Matthew Scarlett up there with, with um, you know, Dustin Fletcher and, and Steve Silvani. He was a unique character. I think at times he was a complex character. But he was the kind of person that bridged the gap, I think, between the public and the players, in the, in the sense where he spoke what he what he thought and was really really revealing. We'll pick that conversation up with Jack. Reed.